Hi, this is Adam from Small Town Machine Shop, and we're in the field again. So we got this pump bolted up. I had to make a repair to the balance tube. It had a pinhole in it. So on these centrifugal or centrifugal pumps, it's very important you reinstall the balance tube. What it does is as this turns, it builds pressure. You have your inlet pressure, your discharge pressure. This comes off the packing end and sends the pressurized high pressure water back to the inlet. It really helps eliminate axial thrust on the motor and the pump. So pretty key. Now, for some reason when manufacturers put these in, like yours, the one over there, there's no unions in them. So you take, it has a compression fitting like this. It goes on there. Yeah, you know, it's just a standard compression thing. This guy sits quite a ways in there. Not enough that you can normally pull it out. So what I do without, you'd have to crack the pump loose there at the volute housing. So what I do is, where did I set? Since I gotta make the new tube anyway and cut to length, I'm going to add a pipe nipple and a union and put the other piece out of there. That way it can be easily disassembled and repaired in the field without having to unbolt the motor and all that other stuff. So another thing, a little pipe tip for you. Whenever you're using pipe nipples, I try to use one I can easily, sometimes you have to use a close one that's, you know, all thread, a little gap, and all thread. That way you don't have, you don't get a pipe wrench on your threads. So if you have room, I always like to use a nipple like that. That way I can get on it with, from, you know, no risk to the threads. I'm gonna have to get that guy out of there. So I have a new one. And yeah. I'll do a little bit here and I'll bring you back. Okay, I'm cutting the new one to size. As you can see, this is why we're, I'm fixing it. Always, 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 it's true of this kind of tubing, it's true of copper tubing. Anytime you cut the tubing with a pipe cutter, always deburrow. I really like this pipe cutter, it's a reed, Got the swivel deburring tool and run that in there until you cannot catch your fingernail on anything. What that does is it causes turbulent spots around here. So absolutely no lip on either end. Okay, I'll keep bringing you along as I go. And there we go. Went ahead and replaced this part too. Thankfully that came out of that packing gland very easily a lot of times these like to snap off in there and you can't get too much heat in there because there's packing in there we added the union so that's very serviceable got our line in looks nice and straight nice and straight yeah balance tube is repaired i don't know how many of you will find this useful but there's some I want to show you guys some more of the work I do out in the field on pumps and stuff. So yeah, this is Adam from Small Time Machine Shop. Please comment, like, and subscribe, and thanks for watching.